So joining us now live from Stockholm is Ericsson's president and CEO, Carl Henrik Svonberg. Good morning, sir. Thank you for joining us. I wanted to start with the idea of how much weakness morning. you see and for how long in the telecom equipment business. Well, first of all, if you look at the market, it's a bit of a blended picture because we have a very strong pickup in the mobile broadband networks, which leads to a strong markets in the U.S., in, in, in Japan, in China, in, in Europe. Uh, but at the same time, we have a weakening in, in some of the emerging markets. Some because there is uh, GDP declines and consumer confidence declines, but it's also because there are credit constraints in some of those markets. Mm. So I think there is some part that, that uh, we'll have to wait until it improves, but the broadband is very encouraging. Now, in the meantime, as we wait for an improvement, you have identified more cost cuts that would be in addition to the 10 billion kroner cost cutting program that will be implemented by the first half of next year. Can you quantify what you're looking at here. Well, I think when you, as you said in your introduction there, if you, if you look at our earnings, we are actually still on 5.5 billion, the same earnings as last year and no decline in Ericsson's business. The fact that we are down in, in reported numbers is because our JVs are, are still showing losses and they are in a very quick and, and strong recovery there from the, from the big uh, sales loss. Uh, we are also taking pretty strong restructuring charges to become even more efficient. Mm. because we are transferring our business into much more IP. And, and we have done two billion US dollars so far of cost reductions over the last two years. And, and we will do a bit more. You'll do a bit more. Now, everyone's expecting more consolidation in the global network equipment business. What do you see happening? Well, when I started seven years ago, we were a dozen players that quoted a network rollout, I remember. Today, there are just a very few left in the Western world. We have probably never been stronger, but we've also got competition from, from, from uh, uh, a couple of, of Chinese uh, vendors. Mm. Uh, so the, the, the arena has changed quite a lot. It may be more consolidation, but it's already very consolidated. All right, thank you so much. We thank you for your thoughts. We've been speaking with Carl Henrik Svonberg. He is president and CEO of Ericsson. He was joining us from Stockholm.